In this video, I'll show you how to add your app to our dashboard and integrate it with your iTunes Connect. So you begin by finding your app here. And then you'll click on the Get Keywords from iTunes button. Here you enter your iTunes Connect username. And password. Once you've done this, you can go to the App Store optimization portion on the left hand column and look at which keywords are pulled up. You'll notice that all of the keywords are in different colors. These are the actual keywords that your app is currently ranking for that you're currently using in the iTunes Store. An orange keyword is a keyword that you're currently using. A blue keyword is a combination keyword. So for example, we're using the word flower and we're also using the word delivery, forming flower delivery. A green keyword means that you're using this keyword in your title. And black keywords are keywords that you rank for, which were shown in the first screen. I've explained how to optimize your keywords in previous videos, but if you'd like to understand the basic logic, again, you're going to want to consider your search score, which is a approximation of how often and how popular that particular keyword is. For example, 1-800-Flowers, which has a search score of 54, is more preferable than Flower Delivery, which only has a search score of 52. Both are good volume of search scores, but you want to obviously go for as high of a search score as you can. Additionally, another factor you want to consider is the number of other apps that are currently using that word. So while 54 and 52 are relatively close, in iPhone apps, 1-800-Flowers only has seven other apps using this keyword, whereas Flower Delivery has 53. So this one is easier to rank for, and which is why this particular app ranks 2 in 1-800-Flowers and 3 in Flower Delivery.